Good morning, Hector Cat Friday Eagles. Today is Wednesday, September 11th, 2024. Today is known as a bunch of different days. Patriot mm -hmm. Day, um, Community Hero Day, Day yep. um, and it was on September 11th in 2001 um, that kind of some events changed the course of history forever. So, you know, every year we pay tribute to the 2,999 996 lives that were lost um, and it's kind of a national day of remembrance and that's why we're dressing up in yep. red white and blue yep. we're yep. appreciative for our community heroes our police our fire our EMS like our teachers yes. um, and it's kind of a day of remembrance and honoring those we lost and who was supported by those tragic events so um, think about that right now when you stand and say the pledge with Miss Santier's class and also when we take a moment of silence I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please remain standing for a moment of silence. may be seated. All right, we're back for another great day of teaching and learning here at Hector Caffra Elementary School. Mr. Licata, you've been talking to us about showing what you know. Um, yep. yep, I know we have that math, the, the math assessment today. I know we're continuing with that math assessment right there. Um, you know, showing what you know, showing what you know with everything you're doing right there. Um, you know, we talked we talk about this as kind of the uh, in time that we can then show your teachers kind of what how instruction is going to go with that. So. Right. Um, so, you know, it's kind of take that time, take it serious, but yet relax and do your best with that. So, okay. um, so yes, we're kind of excited to kind of see where we're at in math and then go from there for instruction for the year. All right, so, perfect. Yep. And special thanks to all the people who have dressed up in red, white, and blue today yes. for supporting yep. our community heroes. You know, um, you know, it's, it was nice to see the kind of patriotism right there, but also like community heroes right there. And we have, you know, some examples of our community heroes that, you know, our firefighters, our doctors, our policemen, our, our our military, so um, take that some time today when you think about someone that you maybe know that's a firefighter or please yeah. say thank you and yeah. um, you know we're all in this together right there. So just kind of something we just never forget and always remember yep. right there. So. Okay, we do have a couple birthdays today. Happy birthday to Sabrina Lopez in grade three and Zane Schwartz in grade five. Happy birthday. Go today. They have a fantastic day and then I know lunch is going to be fantastic. What's for lunch today, crew? Today for lunch we will have milk, soda, fruit, Corn, potato, roaster, and hot dogs or popcorn chicken. Instead of the hot dog or, or chicken, you may have an incrustable peanut butter and jelly sandwich or a chef slap. All right, hot dogs or popcorn chicken. If you don't want that, you can have an incrustable peanut butter and jelly sandwich or a chef salad. Yep, and like to always say, give your mayors on the right say please, thank you, because yeah. our kitchen staff is putting, look at all these choices I that know. they have. It's like a restaurant. Yeah, it is. Mm -hmm. It's like a, a real big buffet restaurant. You have all these choices. So say say thank you when you go through the line, because it is a lot of work putting yep. that together. Yep, so. awesome. Um, and then it's Wednesday, so you know that okay. means we have a science fact today. All right, let's okay? see what it is. So if you know the answer to this science fact, please dial extension 215. 215. Okay, and the question is, what animal is this? What species of animal, right. okay? All right, I mean, I mean yeah, you, know? you have to be specific. Yeah, you got to right? be specific, okay, because there are several varieties okay. of this yes. type of animal, right? Okay, what kind of animal is this? That's... Good morning, you're on the air, who's this? Mr. Santa's class. Hey, and what do you guys think it is? I know, but what type of pelican? We're, we're looking for speci <laughs> specificity today. Do you know what type of pelican? No? All right. It's a certain color. What kind of pelican is that? There's yeah. different varieties. Right, right. So if you know the answer, stop. Good morning. You're on the air. Who's this? Hi, it's Miss Richard's class. What do you guys think it is, Miss Richard? They think it's a blue heron. 
It is not a blue heron. Sorry. Good morning. You're on the air. Who's this? Hey, this is uh, Miss Kesterson with Miss Richard's class. Okay, and what do you guys think it is? We think it's a brown pelican. It is go. a brown pelican. Yay! So congratulations to Miss Richard's, Richard's class because yeah. that is a brown pelican. And what a lot of people, I don't know if you ever see them when they scoop up the yes. fish in the water. They have an extendable sack of skin underneath their beak, like at their throat. It can hold up to three gallons of water, okay? Wow. Which is more than their belly can hold. <laughs> yeah, that's okay. Right there. And speaking of that, Mr. Licata, I have a I have a poem of sorts for you. Okay. okay? Are you ready? All right. What a wonderful bird is a pelican, whose bill can hold more than his belly can. Food for a week he can hold in his beak, but I don't know how the heck he can. <laughs> what do you think? That's perfect for that. I know, right? And it included the scientific facts. There you go. All right, so that's it for today. Don't forget to be respectful, be responsible, be ready to learn. Take some time and think about all those that um, serve our community yep. and those that were lost on 9-11. But most importantly, remember what? Smiles are free. Smiles are free. It's the show with a friend. Think about those community heroes.